music whenever you want. Yes, they will. Come on now, listen to the party. We got some time, Nick Pat, Connor, Cuba, Z, Big Motor, Day, and Evergreen Park. So when you're here, you got nothing to lose. If you don't, then you're a sellout. But you're stupid. Round of applause. Here come the boys. Everton. Tied it up or they're up? Tied it up. Welcome to the pod! What, 2-2? Two, two. What are you, scumbags betting on international <laughs> soccer? I'm just uh, looking. Yeah. I'm just looking. Or did you... You don't oh, even you have a phone it. in your hand. There's, you a, there's, there's a ticker. There's, there's a ticker. ticker. There's, ticker. there's a ticker. <laughs> I'm Tone <laughs> Diggs. That's Boston Connor. I always got eyes up there. That's Ty Schmidt. Hey, don't. That's Nick Marotta. What up? Uh, that's Gababa Gumpina. What? That's Mitt. What? <laughs> Man. Is there anyone else? But, nice. hey, Z- and a big fucking welcome back to Zito. Zito back. 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 Did, you got. Did you just say you beat Got? I beat Got. Had a boy. So it was only Got. I, I got Got. Yeah. You had a more formidable opponent, my friend. Is that right? Uh, did he did? Did you test? I believe I heard you tested positive for for a good attitude. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What? Good- what is it? Is it a secret that you had COVID-19? No. I probably had COVID-20. I don't know. Did two weeks in an iron lung. Yeah. I did. I was in that iron lung. It's a journey. I was, I was eating a lot of hot dogs, though. Mm-hmm. Did you watch anything good? <laughs> uh, I've, I've watched almost everything. I've watched literally every single thing possible. You watched The Manhunts, which watched we all it. watched. Richard yeah. Jewell's my, my guy. Ricky. I think I'm going to get a – I've actually also watched every single season up to season seven of, of uh, was it, uh, Master Inc.? Oh, oh yeah, you no. did say you would crush it. I'm up Ink to Master. season seven. Ink Master. Oh. Yeah. Ink Master is pretty awesome, dude. I, I might get a Richard Jewell <laughs> fucking tattoo. You is should. Gonna say, I'm going to get a dude, Richard Jewell is fucking tattoo. Is it going to say – there's a bomb in the Daniel Park. Just running up your arm. <laughs> Double yoy. Yeah. You just get a fucking. What makes you a dick <laughs> jewel on your back? Dude. Yeah. Or a chest piece. Yeah. <laughs> dick dick well, jewel's head. Yeah. Right, you my know? my new goal in life is to get a tattoo from Chris Nunez though. Oh, Chris oh, Nunez Chrissy? is a fucking stud. Five hundred dollars an hour. I don't know if that's good or not in the tattoo world. Uh, uh, you guys got any steep. good tattoo that's places out here? Yeah, Chris Nunez, dude. <laughs> I, I sent you one. <laughs> What's that? I told you about one. You told me that one stunk. No, no, I told you about one Fucking stunk. But there's there's one parlor. there's one that's really really good. The guy who like did Post Malone is from here. Is like an hour away though. Well, I don't even have a vehicle. Oh, bang me. bang. Well, I mean, you could borrow a vehicle, not mine. Oh, you, you want to come with somebody's. somebody's. I mean, yeah, what? I do it's, need to finish the uh, sleeve. I got some yeah, what did you, what's your plans for that? I mean, Connor, I got the sleeve done. And then I ran into some financial troubles. What? What? <laughs> and then I, then I needed money for a Were wedding. Broke? I hear you. Yeah. I hear you. And I needed money for a house. Got a house, yeah. And that's yep. this feels like the house is going to take up. Bought your dog on a whim. Or <laughs> or <laughs> brought, <laughs> yeah. Buy my dog on a whim. Mm-hmm. No, I hear you. <laughs> feels like, and it feels like I'm going to be stuck here forever. Perpetuating. You can sell situation. your house right now and finish that sleeve. Ooh. Ooh. Think about it. Move back know. to the old hat. I just, yeah. I just drove it off the lot. I think it. <laughs> don't know if you can give it back so oh, yeah. quick. I think the price goes down quite immediately. No, no, no. No, no, no. It goes up. Yeah, it appreciates. In value. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Not That's yet. That's right. Not you, did, yet. you did some stuff to it already, so that probably went up. There yeah. you go. Fucking. Yeah, your goddamn fucking guy gave you COVID. Came in and fucking <laughs> damn near took you out. No, I don't think. I don't know if it was him or not. It might have been the movers. I don't think it was that guy because he said he ha- it does have a uh, debilitating. Yeah, you're spitting your mouth. Debilitating uh, lung disease. If he got it, he said he would be dead. So I don't think it was him that gave it to me. <laughs> oh, okay. Wow. Have you checked on him since? I have That's not. Refreshing. I have not heard from him <laughs> at all. That's because you so soon. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> but yeah, I mean, we got a lot of COVID survivors in here now. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's yeah. awesome. Bill, Bill is Bill. Bill's back too. Bill, yeah, Bill, Bill, Bill. Hey boy, Bill, hey boy, Bill. Congrats, Bill. Good work, Bill. So good to have you back, Bill. Really, Nick? That's not what you were saying. Like, you know, when I came back. Mm. Well, it wasn't. I was just trying to keep up appearances and. I thought he was going to say that's what right said last night. I was like, whoa, <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Bill, congrats on your fight, your win. <laughs> mm-hmm. I'm not. I'm not okay with what's happening with Nick. What do you mean? We, so what? for the longest time we had a truce, okay? Because yeah. we we go at each other, 
pretty hard. What? Right? What? Golden what? spin what? is moff. And then uh, just out of nowhere. You guys got a beef? <laughs> what? You a want tip? a truce? You don't like what? each other? What? <laughs> you want to fight? What? You want to kick the bucket? What? You hate his guts? What? What's it about? He hates you. What? You're scumbag. What? You fucking stink. What? You got COVID. What? You weren't here. What? You armistice. You weren't working. What? You want to war? Doing anything? What? Talking to your battleships. <laughs> fucking penis is a piece of raw baloney right now. What? <laughs> Playing VR. What? <laughs> Browsers. What? Pornhub. What? Naughty America. What? X Port. What? X Amster. What? Minus apartment. What? <laughs> Captain Stabbing. What? What? Hang bus. What? X2. What? Rally Kings. What? <laughs> Mill Hunter. What? Money Talks. What? <laughs> Bullshit Walk. What? What were you saying, Bill? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know anymore. Cam honestly. Girls. What? <laughs> FTV Vids. What? what? Cam Soda. What? what? <laughs> I love Vids Daily. What? <laughs> <laughs> Doublemob.org. What? Coming soon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We have filed for the website, <laughs> doublemouth.org. Mm-hmm. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be like Mr. Skin, but for everything. But better. <laughs> Way better. Mm-hmm. Dr. Skin. What's the homepage going to look like? Tits Fucking. everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking bags being Just dumped out. Your face being vacation. squished by tits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is Bill, Bill, you still back No, he there. left. He, <laughs> he, he, he did got leave. Got stone cold. <laughs> got, stone, <laughs> got stunned out of here. He got, he got stone uh, cold. But what I was saying before, Tony, I've seen every single thing you can watch on TV. You watch Soul? Yeah. Did um, you like it? I did like it. Is there, there, wait, what? The, I think the real question is, is there anything that you watched that you didn't like? Yeah. I loved it all. Didn't think True. so. Because you did like oh, um, 1984, which and, did, and, in fact, oh, kind of stink. Wonder well, Woman stunk. Zane. No, no. I, I said, I, I clarified, lazy writing. You yeah, so it's stunk. Writing. It's okay to say no. things stink. I don't know lazy well. writing or if it was just poor writing. We got another no, good show lazy. on the horizon, my friends. What's that? Oh, yeah. Clarice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think I'm in on Clarice. I mean, I don't know if I'm in on Clarice, but there was also a Queen Latifah fucking <laughs> Oh, action. yes. Right. After Super Bowl. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, what's it called is back soon, too, actually. I think it's, I ba- it's basically Walker, uh, Texas Ranger, but Queen Latifah stuff. It's like the kid has no idea her mom was a cop, and they're like in a parking garage, and Queen Latifah like disarms like eight guys. It's like, all right, what are we doing How here? old is Queen Whoa. Latifah? I don't know. She good looks pretty her. good. Yeah, she looked pretty good. The show looks like it stinks. Oh, the show is called good. The Equalizer. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. The female version of oh, fucking Denzel. Denzel. Yeah. By the way, I did see a sweet preview with Denzel. In and it. Jared uh, Leto. Yeah, that looks good. What the hell is that going to be? Like Little Things, I think it's called. Latifah's yeah. 50 years old. Oh, yeah. Looks good. That was like Snoop. I thought Snoop was damn near 65. Dude's 50, isn't he? Mm-hmm. Well, Snoop's I mean, only 50. He's, 40, he's like 48, I when think. When he did that Snoop splash, I thought he was 25. <laughs> I would have <laughs> also guessed through the air. that Snoop <laughs> was approaching point. 80 years old. Heart. Hardest working man in the biz, Snoop oh, Dogg. Yeah. Well, Snoop he'll just do any. Oh, yeah. yeah, and then on top of it, like he's always high, which is equally impressive to me to not be ever like tired yeah. or drained True. or lethargic. He's just going 100 miles an hour all the time. Hell yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Doing everything. Doing Snoop Splash. Snoop Splash. <laughs> Dude, Snoop Splash. Have Snoop you no. ever Snoop seen. Snoop came off the <laughs> top <laughs> of Snoop Splash. <laughs> have you ever seen balance like that in your life? Yeah. Do you guys know Snoop Dogg's real name? Yeah, Calvin Scout, Bros. Yeah, yeah, Calvin Cortazor. Calvin Cortazor Bradis Jr. Cor- Cortazor Brodus, dude. Brodus, Brodus, Jr. Brodus. What are you drinking there? Fucking uh, chewing there, lemon, lemon, lemon. Tea. Just messing around with some can of dips. <laughs> Nothing better. You having a can you know? of dip? Uh, I'm just playing with the can. It's cool. You lip boomer? It's gold. I wish I was a lip boomer. I'm a sig boomer, Zeta. unfortunately. Uh, what are you, you snacking do? out? Of, were you snacking out in the house? Oh yeah, oh yeah. A lot of snacks. What how many times do you think so you, you lose your taste? Or? How many times do you think I you? Lose my taste. How many times do you think you ordered food over COVID? Uh, like the whole. Like how many times total? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, probably ninety two. What? Ninety two. Ninety three. What? Oh yeah. Sometimes. Well, you got to take advantage of uh, Dash Mart. No free ads, obviously, but Dash Mart, Myers on there now. Oh my. Um, all those other good places. What do they do? 
Dash Mart? Does that give you groceries? It's, yeah. It's yeah. DoorDash. It's a section of okay. DoorDash. But there's a Meyer one now. Where you, I literally got my groceries every time. And it, you got Walgreens on there. Walgreens, DDS. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. Nice. Oh. Do you cough drops? Yeah, all of it. Probably. I mean, it's no Postmates, but... Yeah, no, Postmates so usually. Oh, I love Postmates. Though. I was actually using Postmates That we've been well. reading fucking ass for for... <laughs> Well, Z, you're using that too. You just no, yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm never here for the ads, so I apologize. What? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I love Postmates. Use promo code. The pod. The pod. The pod. The pod. Yeah. Suck it, guys. Uh, it lip does boom. anyone have anything they need to get off the chest that they don't think is gonna be in the folder? Uh, Steelers suck. Well, Whoa. Bears, Whoa. bears suck. <laughs> Wait, There's oh, ruined Nickelodeon oh, for everybody. No, the whole generation of kids grew we up slide? hating football because that terrible slide. game. Yeah. We only got oh one, one. We only got one team left in the dance yeah, out of all of us. Die, yeah. <laughs> oh, Mitt is a fan of like. Oh yeah, yeah Mitt. Who's your team this week? Mitt has like uh, thirteen goes no, no, no. <laughs> Let's not Broncos Nation. <laughs> I'm just a fan of the league. <laughs> Man, how you doing, dude? You, did you watch any cool movies lately? Do you watch Soul? I did not watch Soul. I'm not a big Pixar movie guy. I Whoa. saw Fast and Furious 6. That was the last movie I watched. Pretty Hot. awesome. Whoa. First time ever? Wait, is that the one we already did a review on from you? Um, probably. I Might as well get it again. Yeah, let's hear it. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty cool. <laughs> Who was your favorite character? Uh, Vin Diesel. Well, but, that's uh, not his name, so. Yeah, all right. Well, Tom Toretto. Tom Toretto, I guess. But, yeah, it was cool. They just saved the world. Fun. Hell yeah! Is that Hell when yeah. Dom Toretto goes evil? Nice. Is that the ice Dude, one? Did is you that when write the, the movie? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus! Holy is that shit. when they had the fucking submarine coming through the ice? No, was, uh, that was I think the seventh one. Dude, I don't know. I saw oh, this no. like three it's, weeks. Is this when they were on the like cliff in the back of that fucking yeah the RV. Paul Walker send off? That's mm-hmm. the Paul Walker. Mm-hmm. No, 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 that's, that's seven. seven. That's seven. That's Not seven. That's seven. That's seven. Which one did you watch? Because at the end of it, it says for Paul. Yeah. Paul, I think after at the six, end of they always six, say that. No, at the end of six is when the uh, the what we were talking about earlier is when the uh, Asian guy dies. He yeah. Gets hit by oh, Han. Oh, he dies. Han. Yeah. He dies Jun twice. Tao. That's Hobbs' brother. Jun Tao. Shaw's brother. Jun Tao d- died in an earlier movie. Oh, you're right. That's not me. Jun is Tao Vin, was Rush Hour, yeah. Is Vin Tokyo coming up Drift. in the pod later? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Tokyo Drift. Don't you worry about that. I didn't know if we were going to get into it now. If we, if it no, no. Vin will come up. All right. Let's just let's get into the pod. This comes from uh, Ryan Reynolds' Instagram. Deadpool 3 will join the Marvel Cinematic Universe as an R-rated movie, according to Marvel Studios president Kevin Feige. Feige. Nice. Is Kevin Feige, Feige a real Feige. guy? Feige. Feige. It's Feige? Feige. Yeah. Yeah. Feige. I know. I think it's Feige. I mean, there should be a double G. <laughs> should. Yeah, I, I it's agree. Got, it's spelled like beige. Maybe like yeah. a tilde or something over that E. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Maybe an I-E. <laughs> I, I don't know if you guys do, but I love Deadpool. Hell yeah. I also so do. I'm, I'm pumped to see him get some interaction with some A list Marvel characters and not just the B squad that he's normally running around with. Yeah, well, that's the well thing. Said. Unless Hulk is telling Thank some you. guy to suck his dick in this movie. That's yeah. right. He might. <laughs> and I don't want to see it. You he know? might. Don't you think he might? I hope. I think by him. Wait, you don't want to see Deadpool 3? I think Ruffalo. No, I'm going to watch it either way, but I just hope that, you know, Mark Ruffalo's, you know. Beating the fuck out of some people swearing at him. With his hog. Yeah. He's probably going to bang out uh, Black Widow. ScarJo? Yeah. She's dead. Yeah, she did die. Yeah. She's this dead. is Deadpool, dude. If she's okay. dead, how's she got a movie coming out? Whoa. Prequel, bro. Whoa. <laughs> maybe fucking this. Maybe Deadpool's going to be a prequel. Oh, that's true. Oh, that could be. Maybe well, he's also now. in uh, the new Doctor Strange one as well. Really? Uh huh. WandaVision? No, no, that's not Doctor Strange. You know WandaVision. WandaVision Wanda starts soon. Here. Friday. I think this yeah. week. Yeah, Friday. Yeah, starts Friday. I don't get it. You don't I, get it. I, I, think what, I don't get it. I think essentially it's just going to be Wanda and uh, Vision just like in their own little bubble. And, uh, Fucking. They're going after him. Yeah. They're trying to find him, kill him. Who's yeah. that? The government, dude. The man. The Dementor. CIA. <laughs> CIA, yeah. Can you imagine if the Dementors made an appearance? Worst part about prison. <laughs> that is worst part. <laughs> By far. By far. <laughs> the worst part about life is that I don't get to watch The Office anymore. I can tell you that. Oh, I do. I love it. Well, <laughs> you peacock and son of a bitch. Peacock's I awesome. love it. <laughs> he finally gets the flex for having <laughs> peacock. They break it down in really cool little fucking is little there, sections. Dude, I was going to say, is there really like... Di- 
Oh, really? And Dude, uh, you fucking go on to the TV shows tab, and you're just looking for regular Office, and it's like, The Office Collections, and it goes through all <laughs> Best them. Dwight, best Michael yeah. Scott, best fucking Kelly. But they don't just have, like, can I just continue watching the <laughs> fucking episodes? Really like Kelly, just... dude. Huh? <laughs> Kelly it has be best there. Kelly? Probably. What, did she know. force it on there? I'm just ready for <laughs> best of Kevin. That's all I remember. Uh, That's the only tab. They, uh, they, nice. they extended all season three, too. They, it's all extended. Yeah, they and all those uh, new opens that they have, too. Yeah. You know what, Tony? This is good for you. This is healthy. Because you Stop. would always just you know, resort to your old tricks and go watch yeah. The Office. Now you'll find new shows. Well, I got all this pent-up aggression, like because I watch shows. Like, I watch a show that I'm just watching. Pin it yeah. down. And then the half hour to 45 minutes before bed when I want to wind down. Yeah. And clear my mind, throw on two episodes of The Office. I rewatched Psych too, by the way. Ooh. The Peacock. Nice, dude. Oh, yeah. yeah that show stinks, right? <laughs> amazing show. We thought about Show stinks. It's I thought you love Psych. It's USA Network show. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, if it's on, USA, USA, if you. If it's on USA and I didn't watch it, it definitely stinks. Wow. So Burn Notice is better. But you're didn't a company man. Notice. No, Tony loves Burn Notice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Listen, That's I don't. Horatio Kane is God, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Whoa, 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 Michael whoa, Michael Weston, whoa, whoa. act like you don't know the Take fucking main character. Take that back. Horatio Kane is a legend. Stinks next. <laughs> oh, Vin Diesel's, yes. Diesel reveals his experience with Marvel and Avengers Endgame inspired him to craft a two-part finale for Fast and the Furious. So it's going to be like Endgame. It's going to be, yeah. Yeah, end game and everyone's going out. I mean, fucking F ten part one, F ten <laughs> part two. Yeah. So is Vin writing these movies at this point? <laughs> Essentially, I believe he has. Is there anything taken a this man can't? Do? Is Cena part of the first end game? Well, we're gonna find out in nine. You know. Yeah, this next Who knows one. What I'm, happens? Yeah, to right. Jacob I love that Toretto. his experience with Marvel is what inspired him. To craft these two what, tales. What are you talking down on? Don't say, don't talk, don't pretend like Marvel's fucking leaps and bounds above Fast and well, no, Furious. Yeah, That's I mean, what I'm saying. Yeah, like, it's, no, the, no shit, dum dum. You make <laughs> fucking two movies, you're gonna make a bunch of money. Is I anyone know. not doing this anymore? Yeah. This is this is the fucking Twilight common mold. Did it, Harry everyone Potter does did it. Yeah. Well, like it's money games. out the ass. Well, normally the Fast movies, like they they've got a villain, Leprechaun they defeat movies. the villain, mm-hmm. new villain in the next movie. I mean, this is gonna have. A super villain that takes two movies. I just hope that he identifies the Hulk and not Iron Man, you know, just because, of course, the end game mm-hmm. itself. You do not. I mean. You know what, what I'm saying. If, Wait, what? If Vin's laying underneath the car at the end of this. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> just let me go. It's got a, <laughs> I hope not. Hey, I hope it's, not. He's got a tailpipe impaled through his chest. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. <laughs> I can make it. He would make it. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> But I'm worried Jacob Toretto might put Can you a bullet. Imagine yes, if we know. never had Fast and Furious. Cena comes with a fucking welding mask Some and fucking, fucking Desert Eagle and just. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's my series now. Mm-hmm. That might be how it ends. Hope I mean, whoa. Hopefully not. Hopefully not. I never understood this guy working with Marvel to begin with. He only has two He's lines. Fucking Groot, One dude. line. Yeah. You ever see him do yeah. I'm Groot in 37 different languages? Uh, yeah. It's insane. <laughs> awesome. It's absolutely insane. Is he the only person Ach-Nock's on set Groot. that has to learn other languages? Yep. Oxnock Groot. <laughs> do the South African. So Groot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Groot, Groot. Hey, Groot, Groot. 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 Could have cast anyone to do it. No. Anyone could have done it. Needed no, so I don't know. Needed no. Needed no. It's, it's, it's incredible finesse on his part in the studio, I guess, to, yeah. to so, work him in. So good. Bring me <laughs> Vin. Next. Oh. Talks about it quite a bit today. The uh, CIA has declassified UFO docs. Um, have you got into... Uh, I've yeah. gotten into a few. I mean, there really isn't anything to report here just yet because of the length. That these things we do are, need is spark notes. There yeah. are so they are uh, the CIA will be debriefing Congress on this. Really? Oh yeah. Um, they released it before actually debriefing them, so I think that's when we're going to really find out some. Of the Saul more nuts is going to debrief Congress on. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, that yes, and also you know I don't completely believe that the CIA is revealing all of the information they have, even though they're no, saying this you is don't all the say. Listen, you know? Patinkin doesn't withhold information, my mm, friend. I don't know. I don't know. Mystery explosion in small Russian town. Yeah, until the Galactic Federation comes down, we're not going to know. Have they trotted out the alien in front of the 
<laughs> Fucking everyone, Paul? yeah. Not yet. They're keeping that yeah. son of a bitch locked up real tight. They have not wheeled him out yet. <laughs> he will be soon, though. Yeah. I, I heard he yeah, got a little stage fright. What's up? Once, playing once in the back when they fucking COVID. tried him out. Fucking once. Hogan, baby. I am a real American. <laughs> Pushing him. <laughs> is he in a wheelchair? <laughs> no, he's in a wheelbarrow. Yeah. Oh, I thought he's, he's being doing the Hogan. He's doing the Hogan. <laughs> yeah. So he's not like on a dolly in a glass. No, no, case. no, no, no. This no. thing is Hello, breathing fucking yeah, it's, air. Yeah, H two O. Yeah, H boy. That's the that's thing about the aliens is that uh, they can breathe water, air. Yes, that is. Oh, he might have a that's, fucking t-shirt cannon. Yeah. <laughs> Don't buy my merch. They're so wearing, a, wearing yeah. an Uncle Sam t shirt. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully. Use him to, yeah. That'd be sick. Sam. Fingers crossed. They use sense. him to recruit for the fucking Galactic War. I'm glad sense. he's on our side. Mm-hmm. I can't, I can't wait. wait. Can't wait. When you picture this alien getting trotted out, I picture a few different ones. See, I only picture one Cam Newton. No. Oh. Uh, the alien from Signs. Oh, that's, that's the one dude. you're going with? Come on, dude. Who are you going with? I think more like uh, the one from The Simpsons. Oh, the I big like glass tube over his head and his dangly tentacles. I don't like that one. <laughs> it could be. So I'm thinking it's like a mix of like the Independence Day ones with Paul. Like They're all scary looking massive. But then they start talking. It's like, oh, this this guy's awesome. He's cool. <laughs> Did you say mixed you know? with, with who? Paul? Paul. Yeah. Paul, like yeah. Walker? No, no. Oh, the, no. the movie oh, Paul. Oh, I've never seen Paul. Oh, yeah. It's really oh, good. You should watch Seth that. Rogen. Dude, it's so yeah. good. Is it new? The dude from Hot yeah. Fuzz, I think, no. is in it. Oh, fucking British guy? Yeah. Fat guy or skinny guy? Run, fat boy, run. Fat guy? Yeah. Vince Vaughn? Simon Pegg. Simon Pegg. Oh, I thought Simon Pegg was skinny guy. Yeah, he is. He's in the movie called Run Fat Boy Run. <laughs> I, I see what I, I fucked you up there, but no, Simon Pegg, yeah. The dad in, um, Simon Pegg is the dad in uh, The Boys. Mm-hmm. Hot Fuzz, too, right? At World's End, yeah, Hot Fuzz. Uh, yeah. Zombie, zombie movie. Uh, what? They yeah, did yeah, do Hot a Fuzz. version of zombie movie. Is that English? What are you oh, talking Hot Fuzz about? Is, oh, zombie. Uh, Shaun of the Dead. Thank Shaun, you. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Great movie. <laughs> When they start fucking that beating them awesome. with bats to uh, Queen, can't stop me now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, great cinematic. Don't stop me now. Yeah. Don't stop <laughs> me now. Well, can't stop me now. <laughs> Don't stop me now. Uh, we'll, we per- we'll report further on these uh, documents later. Yeah, there'll be more stuff coming out. Next. I want to see a ship too. Everything's redacted though, right? Uh, not everything. There are a few files in there that's like the whole entire Just the report. stuff that is going to cause mass hysteria. Yeah, probably. So everything. Yeah, mostly. Anything new. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Boys, I had a 10-day isolation because I forgot it takes all of us and got COVID. Welcome. Oh, yeah. Welcome. So these, I started listening to the episodes of the pod from episode one. Shock, 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 no, I have a shock, few shock, questions shock, I think need answering. Shock, uh, shock, is the shock gang shock, dead? Is it? This shock, 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 shock. No. Shock, shock. No, Some would say hibernating it is. It's hibernating. Sharks, of the ocean. sharks are in shot, the shot, Mariana shot, Trench. Like the Megalodon. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, does Tony still have the roller skates or did he manage to get someone to steal them? They're not in my... They didn't make the move, I can tell you that. <laughs> really? I think they're in the office. Just yeah, I thought Mitt brought them in one day oh, for yeah. Ty. Yeah. yeah Tony, I, I think they're, they're in the them. office in case of emergency, mm-hmm. in case we need them here. So yeah. Mitt did steal them. Donate them to the office. Uh, did Rock Band ever materialize uh yes but uh it does not work on the xbox one <laughs> so, uh, unfortunately no <clears throat> have the fbi been in touch with connor no i actually do have to call them and i have to call the irs <laughs> <laughs> did tony ever get to the bottom of the bread in the yard i did not he had to move away but That's i moved I, was. But I got out yeah. so <laughs> true i'm thinking a crow was carrying a piece of bread from another yard yeah fucking death crow dropping it yeah squirrel maybe i don't know mm. I feel like a crow would eat that bread. Or your I don't neighbor think carrying it very far. Accidentally ate it. Or your it, neighbor was trying to kill your dogs. Yeah, I think I think that one. Yeah, well, it stopped. Put rat poison in a fucking piece of bread. It stopped. There. Well, good for you. You know, stomping him. <laughs> you fucking stomped that guy. Well, because I start I started just throwing it back in the yard. Yeah, yeah. Unless oh, well, Tony's like Richard Jewell and actually planted the bread himself. Yeah, an inside uh, job. Well, first off, it wasn't. <laughs> if you're such a big Richard Jewell fan, it wasn't Dick Jewell. Whoa, that's not true. Yeah, actually. You t- you're talking about getting a tattoo of the guy. You think he fucking Z. planted the bomb? What do you? <laughs> I don't want to get deep in my conspiracies. But nah, I only watched first episode. <laughs> <laughs> no, Rich was the man, though. How much did you love when fucking Dick Joel was running that seven and a half minute 
Oh, I could have got that in like three minutes. I just watched that part. It was fucking awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite part so far by far. Uh, next. I told you. <clears throat> got this sent in by a lot of people. You can only pick three to be in your movie. And it's The Rock, Brad Pitt, Jamie Foxx. Rob Williams. Rob Williams. Uh, De Niro. Denzel. Mm -hmm. Leo. Uh, Tom Hardy. Pacino. Hanks. Crow. Morgan. F Morgan Freeman. Bale, Will Smith, Ryan Gosling, and Matt Damon. Wow. Tony. Well done. <laughs> wow. Jesus. Well done. Jesus Christ. Christ. Roger Ebert over there. <laughs> fucking, Seriously. Yeah. I, I almost had a fucking Seriously. aneurysm. Yeah. Boy, is my brain bad. Pick three in your movie. <laughs> Go. <clears throat> this is very difficult. Brad Pitt's automatically in my movie. Okay. Okay. <laughs> 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 okay. Tom Hardy's in my movie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's three, Tony. I know. I'm. I'm I mean, I'm th we're all thinking out loud here. See, uh, now, I I'm, think I might go with Denzel as yeah. my third. What's your movie called? I see. That was also. I don't know what my movie is. What's it about? Because there could potentially be a movie where all I need is The Rock. How does Vin not on I don't here? think The Rock is a guy I absolutely <laughs> need in my movie. But I'm saying if it's know? that type of movie, it doesn't matter what movie. It's it's Brad Pitt, it's Tom Hardy, and it's Denzel. And we're making a fucking sweet movie. See, I'd go Denzel if it was Lex Lumpkin as Denzel. <laughs> oh, you know what I'm saying? I like so that. So if it was Lex Lumpkin as a Denzel. But there's also like a, uh, Disney's The Kid exactly. remade. Yes. There's Bruce also a movie Wilson where I did. need fucking Bale Crow. And uh, De Niro. Yeah, go ahead. Take Tom them all, Leo. Tony. <laughs> yeah. What yeah. <laughs> we got two more to choose from. Gonna, <laughs> they, I, they go together in threes. I think I'd go Bale, Denzel, and and Leo. I thought you were going Gosling for sure. Guy Gosling's the man, but, you know, I mean. Uh, Denzel, Russell Crowe, Tom Hardy. See, we're all so huh. similar here. We're all, like, I wanted ben, Bale. I wanted Denzel. I'm keeping Bale. I don't care. I'm going Bale. And then just to be different, I'm taking Hanks okay. and Freeman. That's a good move. Okay. Yeah. I'm remaking uh, Good Will Hunting and taking Robin and... Uh... <laughs> no. He was in it. <laughs> no. no, I know. Oh, I know. I'm, re I'm basically replacing Ben Affleck with The Rock. Rob Williams is <laughs> so also... You're taking, <laughs> you're taking Robin, Matt Damon, and The Rock. Who are you doing, Good Will? Who's, who's the one actor you would throw out on here? Oh, who do you think? Well, is it the same for everyone? Uh, honestly, on this list, it might be. Yeah, I think so. Too. Hold on, let me go through. Me... No, go ahead, boys, say it out loud. Let the words flow from your lips. It's it is. Be free. Yeah, it's Will Smith. It's Will Smith. Be free. Uh, it's a no brainer. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it is. Uh, take out who are you gonna? Who well, are you, I mean, who are you gonna? goodbye, Will. <laughs> technically, it's been nice. Technically, Bob Williams has already been taken off oh, this list. Ah, shut you the piece fuck of up, shit, dude. That's what I was thinking. Sure. Sure. That's what I was I love thinking. What did you just say, Mitt? You love talking about dead people. I don't know why. Whoa! Whoa. I mean, I'm just pointing oh, out the shit. just pointing out the obvious. Who's your Tony. three, Mitt? I don't oh, know I don't know who these guys are. Bugs Bunny oh. isn't on this board. So <laughs> pick anybody. Bugs Bunny, Joe Jonas. Uh, I mean, De Niro and Pacino are getting left off just because you no. Know, I mean, they're pretty old at this point. I mean, we saw the Irishman, Bob De Niro, beating old. up people at 80 years old. Just didn't, even the, all CGI in the world couldn't help that. See, but that's, I mean, it's tough because if you go back, like I, I watch Goodfellas on, uh, oh, on Saturday night it's at 2.30. It's still, I mean, God, it's fastball. Yeah, very late. All right, I rewind it. If you, get a, if you get a, every one of these actors in their primes. Oh, I'll um, change my decision. De Niro. Uh, I think I'm going to take Gosling no matter what. I like that. And then I think I'm going to go Jamie Foxx. I can't actually. believe Z didn't take Jamie yeah. Foxx. I think I'm going to go Jamie Foxx. Didn't my Jamie dear Fox. friend? <laughs> You're talking about my dear friend Jamie? Jamie Foxx? Yeah. Yeah, Is Jamie Foxx the one that hates you? No, he loves no, me. He loves me. What's up, bro? It's T-Pain. T-Pain hates you. Yeah, T-Pain is. And Buster Rhymes hates you. <laughs> my face. Oh, no, no, no. Buster Rhymes, his, his security guard hated me. Five, six, seven in their prime. De Niro, yeah. Denzel, yeah. and Leo would yeah. be pretty it's electric. Yeah. Why isn't Liam Neeson on this list? Yeah, it's dumb. Why isn't fucking Mel Gibson on this list? Take Al Pacino out. Smart. Why isn't fucking uh, Ransom? I love that yeah. movie. Oh, I watched Fat Man. Put the bunny in the box. Oh, how was Santa it? Claus. Not bad. It was a fun little watch. Okay. It was entertaining. Did you Keep watch that, Tate? Yeah. 
good. No, you Love didn't. Oh, yeah? You didn't watch it. What's this? Z, you watched Tenet? Oh, no, I was actually going to, but I heard you got to watch it four times, so I did not do it. Yep. She ought to do it. does think. Yeah. you watch seven seasons of <laughs> Master Inc. <laughs> Master Inc. is so good, but dude. Ink Master first oh, and yeah. foremost. <laughs> I apologize. Uh, I even watched uh, Miami Inc. I got that out of 2004. Miami Inc. Yeah, with the fucking Chris Nunes and his other two homeboys. See, how wild is it when like it's the first round and there's people that aren't that great and they bring in the human people to Oh, they're going to get fucked over. Yeah, and, like. and these people... Just get leave with like the worst tattoo of all time. Uh, after season two, they started doing. Uh, they all basically the the canvases uh, basically picked a loser, and they just fucking yell at each other and be like, "Oh yeah, yours fucking sucks." Well, the worst is <laughs> the worst is when um, they get stuck with a human who wants like this huge like thigh On piece or back piece, mm-hmm. and then like two seconds in, the person starts crying, and they're like, "I can't do it." I can't do it. So they're like, they can't do the tattoo, and then they automatically get fucking sent home pretty much. Yeah. Jeez. It's wild. I watched, I, I probably got four seasons in. Z. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm in Rivals right now. Ooh. Nice. About to finish that. The scene. girl tattoo artist who won Z is from Pittsburgh. Which was that I one? remember her name. It's fucking, fucking Bags Malone? Dave Navarro still oh, rocking dude, out on Dave there. Navarro, great host, by the way. Yeah. Good host. The one episode, he bangs Carmen Electra. Oh, yeah. Wow. The one episode? Yeah, oh, yeah, of Ink Master. Oh, yeah, dude, it's fucking insane. Yeah, they were like, they were like married. Out. No, no, but I'm saying on the episode, he yeah, bangs out. Like, he's on the tattoo I would table so. fucking banging her out. Yeah. Good. It's Close your awesome. eyes, boys. Boys. His ex-wife. You know? Fucking season three, episode 11. Yeah. Yeah. Thank Thank fuck you. yeah. Thank you. Next. That will be on dumpemout.com. <laughs> org. <laughs> Dot org. Nick, this is from Reddit. What does T-I-L mean? Today I learned. Today I learned. <laughs> you uh, <know> Willem, <laughs> Willem Dafoe's confusing large penis is so large that in the movie Antichrist, a penis double was used to not intimidate the audience. Bill Defoe. That was his face. Bill Defoe is a monster. <laughs> Look Bill, at my penis. Bill Defoe. <laughs> Bill the Fall has a fucking python. The how original was John Hamm. Yeah. How was he flying around on the hoverboard with that thing? Fucking, that was his fucking oar. Fun fact, uh, if you've ever seen the movie Body of Evidence starring Bill Defoe and Madonna, uh, Madonna was actually cast because she was the only woman alive at the time that could handle <laughs> Bill Defoe's large heart. Damn. <laughs> yes. Is that a, well, that's a real report? Yeah. Yeah, you can yeah. find it. Like, that is a AMC. good movie, too. Mm-hmm. Good sex scenes in that Catch movie. Oh, yeah. at, uh, Madonna does dump them out. We'll be adding that to dump them out. Dot org she does, huh? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. With Bill Defoe? Do you see his hog? Yeah. Uh, Bill no, Defoe's. Couldn't get in one shot. Right. Yeah. You know. Bill Defoe's hog at the time, actually, yeah. the way they were shooting the film. <laughs> they had to use a 360 camera. Too large, yeah. Did anyone know this before? Was it 8 millimeters? Before, did anyone know this before today? Yeah, it was like, yeah, 75 millimeters. About the phone, did anyone know this before today? I mean, I just no. assumed the Green Goblin. I thought Goblin's John Hamm owned, yeah. owned Hollywood in the penis department. Yeah. Ham has a great marketing department on that. If you yeah. go back and watch uh, Platoon, that scene where he gets shot and he's like, you know, gets shot like 100 times, you can see his fucking penis just flopping against <laughs> his leg in it. <laughs> So yeah, maybe the, go back uh, and check that out. The ties came loose. They they did have it strapped down, but <laughs> yeah, go back and check it out. Next, yeah, check it out. Got a fucking huge dick. It says he's a Guinness Book World Record for the pod fod. <clears throat> Are you a lazy big fat stooge? If after falling asleep on the couch watching TV, you choose to sleep there all night instead of getting up and going to bed? This guy sent this immediately after he woke up on the couch <laughs> Friday morning. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not sleeping on my fucking couch. If I wake up, I'm going to get in my bed. Get up. Depends if you got a comfy couch. Yeah, I've done it. Yeah, that doesn't make you a fat stooge. It kind of makes you a stooge, but... Just lazy as fuck. I don't know if I should comment on this. (laughs) Please do. (laughs) Well, I do. I like to fall asleep on my couch all the time. Do you get up and go to... No, no, this isn't talking about... It's fine with falling asleep on the couch, but when you wake up... If I wake up... Say it's like 2 a.m. Yeah, if I go to your bed... If I wake up and it's like 4 a.m., and I'm getting up at seven. I'm I'm done. I'm staying on the couch. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, it's true. We've come too far. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't know. It feels great to crawl into that bed, no matter what time. It does. It is. Yeah. Depends on your couch setup too. You got a bunch of blankets on your couch, oh, or yeah. you, how far away? You got a real too. pillow, or you got a fucking decorative pillow? I love taking my real pillow to the couch. Yeah, you got it. Oh, see, I've. 
Just some coffee Sleepy decorative. Sleep. No, I've never taken my real pillow oh. on the couch. Take what? Well, not never, but like take it. as an adult, I don't normally. Yeah, no, just take it. You should try it, dude. Yeah, yeah try it out. Good try one. Because then you're just going out too. there with, with the plan to go to sleep. Oh, yeah. Comforter on the couch. No, you just favorites. plan to get comfy. But I mean, you're going to sleep. <sighs> yeah, it's interesting. <clears throat> I'm, still, huh. I'm going to my bed. Nah. Teach their own, you know. Teach their like, own. Yeah, good luck, you know. Teach their own, you know. Mm-hmm. If your bed stinks, fucking sleep on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Or you could have if two cat- beds. What if you had two beds? That's a good idea. No couch. Then you're kind of a psychopath. A, but. a bed in the living room, huh? <laughs> Let's be another bedroom. Mattress on the floor. <laughs> Guest bedroom. Yeah. The mattress on the floor in the living room is an incredible play. I do love to Come lay on my couch. <laughs> Come lay right next to me. <laughs> <laughs> it's a futon. It's a futon. <laughs> next. Denmark launches a children's TV show oh, about a Defoe. man with a giant <laughs> penis. <laughs> The fuck finally got a TV show. And they're, they're they're getting some they're getting some blowback. Um, Why? The guy's name is John Dillermand, and he has an extraordinary penis. So extraordinary, in fact, that it can perform rescue operations, uh, etch murals, hoist a flag, and even steal ice cream from children. Oh yeah, here it is. <laughs> lighter fluid on the grill, cooking them burgers. His penis is currently putting lighter fluid <laughs> on the grill. Did your dick touch my fucking burger? So, goddamn fire! And this host. is on a major network in Denmark or wherever. It said it was like equivalent to the BBC or like CBS. So, anyone interested in how you play those flowers? <laughs> <laughs> well, did anyone watch the show? Was it good? I have. I saw this article <laughs> kids, today. So I don't think. Yeah, I don't I think, think it, it did too well. Good. I haven't had a chance to watch the show, but I probably will be watching. I mean, if he's fucking. If he's, he's cooking burgers with his penis. Stealing ice cream from kids with his penis. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Yeah. Hey, and this is a cartoon. This honestly seems right up my alley. I'll do one for the boys and watch it. I got you guys. There you go, Mitt. There you go, Mitt. Mitt, hey, Mitt. Mitt. Mitt if you don't watch it by next episode, there's going to be serious repercussions. Yeah. All right, I mean, it I looks it. hysterical. It looks I mean, so it, funny. If you, if you You're going to have to give this guy a head job. All right, here's the question. If you could teach your penis one skill okay, that it could do. What would it be? Oh, shit. Wash my car. Okay. <laughs> Fucking be able to pee sitting down. You can't pee sitting down. Like, you if you're driving in a room. car, right? Okay. If you're driving in a car, just being able to well, just, you like... you just flop it out the window? Put, put, a, put a bottle just, like, in your fucking <laughs> pee hole. Fucking and just it. fucking finds it and pees into it. So it's like, it's like a snake searching out a bottle in your car. Exactly. <laughs> you can't do that already? How often you got to pee difficult. in your car? You got to pee in your car a lot, huh? I just sometimes I forget to pee in the morning. And I'm on my way to work and I'm like, fuck, I wish I could just pee in my car. <laughs> probably use it as your windshield, like you know? fluid. Could. This yeah. is why I thought you were talking about like on a road trip. Yeah, a road this trip. This is you on the, no, he lives five on minutes, the five he lives minute drive five to work. Hey, office. look, road trip, it would work on a road trip as well. Oh. I'm just saying, in this scenario, pee in a bottle. I love the way your brain works. Pee in a bottle. It would help. Tell you what, I'd love. Throwing a football would be pretty <laughs> sweet. sweet. Yeah. Slinging it around. Yeah. So I just love fucking holding Talking it. Talking to basketball. You know? I'd love if my penis can use keys. I'd like it to open open doors. Oh, hands are full. Yeah. yeah. That's a good mm. one, yeah. Coming in from the grocery store. Yeah, just if it could grasp anything, really. Something's out of reach. The claw! Grab that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if my dick had a hand, I definitely would have picked one of those. Yeah. If, it could, if it could shake hands, that'd be pretty fucking pretty sweet. 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 This is a wild concept, though. Shaking hands? The fact that it's, <laughs> I just can't get over the fact that it's got lighter fluid in its, in its grasp right now. Hey, it's a dangerous game. Down here. <laughs> Next. <laughs> a steady hand. Penis Speaking of poor. penises, big penis show today. Oh, shit. Jesus, Tony. What? Go ahead. You got one of these, Tony? No, I don't. But I, I saw the article. Um, sure. So there's an app. It's called Cellmate. <laughs> Um, it's it's for I guess it's for you and your mate, and it controls uh, a chastity belt type thing for for men. So I guess never worn a chastity, but I guess you lock your penis up. Oh yeah, lock and key. I guess. This <laughs> looks like a heavy duty cock ring <laughs> so, that attaches to a cellular device to lock your penis down. And your part, <laughs> I think your partner controls it. Okay, like okay, your penis is a lot out now. That makes sense. Oh, yeah, I mean, you can't give the inmates keys to the asylum. Yeah. True. Okay, but this app. Need a warden. This app was hacked. Oh, shit. So no one was 
lot. was getting a lot out, out of jail. And the message on the app from the hacker said, your cock is mine now. <laughs> <laughs> Until they paid a ransom to free their penis. Genius idea. Genius idea. Yeah. Genius Shout idea. Shout out to this hacker. If, Seriously. If you, the hacker was probably going through the app store and was like, all right, what's one app I can hack, which I know people are going to pay me? I'm going to tell you right now, the, this Q company was the reason who hacked it. They hacked their own company. So what? The Q company, powered by Kuaoyu. They're, they're the people who act uh, their own company. Oh, you read the read this or no? But that's that's. I've been watching a lot of murder mysteries, and that's it. Nice. That's so right. you think this company made a bunch? You're of saying these. the company that made this? Yes, Quayo. You. you again, you're insinuating it's an inside job. Yeah, <laughs> very much inside job. Did you watch Inside Man over break? <laughs> I watched a lot of murder mysteries. Inside Man was one of them. Inside Man also not an inside job. Also, <laughs> not, <laughs> put that on the table. Also not a murder mystery. No. Wait, what? What? Uh, what was uh, your favorite murder mystery that you watched? Clue? What? <laughs> Clue. <laughs> nice. Clue's a great movie. <laughs> Clue's a great movie. I don't know if I've Any seen more <laughs> I mean, you're not Wait, missing much. Wait, stinks, right? Yeah. That, no, yeah, that's that's that not movie great. stinks. Clue? Uh, Knives yeah. Out. Oh, that's what I was talking about. Knives Out Knives stinks. Knives Out's a good one. Knives Out's a great Knives movie. Out. Knives Out, Knives out doesn't good. stink. Dustin Craig, right? No. Making a, yeah, yeah Dustin, Dustin Craig. Dustin Craig. <laughs> mm-hmm. They're making a second one, too. Yeah. Knives Out 2? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Shrink, shrink. Is Dusty uh-huh. Craig coming back? <laughs> Too nice. That's what I figured would pop up. Yeah. <laughs> Craig Dustin? <laughs> we were on the same page. Oh, yeah. I pictured I, the book. I saw it when you said it. Shrink, shrink. <laughs> Not, but Knives Out 1 seemed to, seemed to end. I think mm. Daniel Craig is Follow on a him. new oh. case. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So he's like dab, dab. cast another bunch Edward of- Sis- no Ed, um, Sherlock Holmes. Sherlock Holmes. Yeah, Eddie Holmes. Mm. Edward Holmes. <laughs> Edwin Holmes. I think you were thinking of Anola Holmes maybe. Mm. Don't trust uh don't trust uh technology to oh. to keep your penis in a lock. No. 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 Go back to the old fashioned. This is where you stick to your old fashioned mm-hmm. chassis. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Lock, lock and key. key. Lock and key. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Next. Supposedly, chassis belts made your dick smaller back in the day because it was so confined. Oh, like binding uh, Chinese woman feet. Exactly, mm, yep. yeah. Mm. Excuse me? Mm. Makes sense. In, uh, in uh, Asian culture, mm-hmm. they bind their feet. I did hear that story before. I never understood why they wanted their feet to be smaller. Uh, Just one of those a, things. It's a feminine thing where your feet smaller. It's yeah. a... It's a a better looking are Asian more women affordable bo- shoes are Asian yeah. women that women sure. born with larger feet no uh, oh they could be but that's why they bind them and stop it yeah. before they could grow like bamboo yes yes yeah cut it off at the root uh huh it's like being large uh in the Japanese culture large marge and Chinese yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. there you go mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. is this why waist trainers were invented no no they, they want to be bigger <laughs> they want to be big big means power yes. Okay. Yo! Like royalty. <laughs> Big waist. Like yeah. that attractive Cute woman, face. that attractive uh, Romanian woman that we saw the one that time that was looked like Z. Z. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Mm. Very powerful, yes. Same type of. Brought all the deal. boys to the yacht. <laughs> to the yacht? Mm-hmm. Yeah. My milkshake brings all the boys to the yacht. And they're like, that's better than yaws. <laughs> and I'm like, that's better than yaws. I can teach you. But I have to crawl? Yeah. There we go. Nailed it. Do you have Portillo's over break? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you get? What was the order? I always get cheddar beef croissant, uh, hot dog on the side, cheese fried, a Coke. Oh. 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 What? Hot peppers, obviously. What? what? <laughs> you don't get the sausage with the beef beef on top? Uh, combo? Oh, I, I haven't done a combo in a while. I always do croissant. That's croissant, my go-to. Croissant. Yeah. I love the sausage with the beef on top. Combo. It's called we Combo, We used to have a place guys. called, what was it called? It's called it's a Combo. combo. <clears throat> Tootsies. Tootsies. The, oh. Toots. Walking home from the bar at night. You got Tootsies, get one of those. Second Strip floor, level. Tootsies get in Italian beef. What? Oh. What? <clears throat> Bad news. What? Gorillas test positive for coronavirus <laughs> at the San Diego Zoo Safari Park. Oh, shit. Eight <clears throat> gorillas that this lived together. This baby got it? I don't know if the picture is misleading or not. I do believe it is a stock photo. That baby does have an old face, though. Very old face. The baby looks soul. baby looks like it's got Benjamin buttons. It looks face. like Patrick Stewart. He does. Fucking. Patrick Stewart. <laughs> that Patrick baby St- has more hair than Patrick Stewart's ever had in his life. Patrick Stewart looking as fucking gorilla baby. 
That's the first. That's the only thing I can say. I can all right, forget I about the, fucking Professor X. Forget about the coronavirus. <laughs> How'd they get this? How'd they get this girl to look like Patrick Stewart? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Patrick Stewart. Fuck the and girl. does it have Benjamin Button's disease? <laughs> oh, that's fucked. Uh, See, did you give the gorillas Corona? I did not. I did not go to any zoos during my my quarantine. Z flew to San Diego, <laughs> sprayed his mouth. <laughs> So that what? They're just going to put a bullet in all eight of these gorillas' heads and <laughs> oh, call it a day like Harambe? If I had guessed, <laughs> oh, it's although close. the difference between Harambe and well, in this uh, situation. A little bit, little bit different. Little the gorilla exhibit may be closed for a few months. Is it, that what you're saying? It might be, yeah. A few months, few years, they actually have to let the babies grow up to reopen it, you know? Yeah. Gee. Unfortunately. Well, I mean, this baby has to grow down, but. They might ship in a few. <laughs> That's true. It does have to grow down. <laughs> <laughs> is Benjamin Button disease a real disease? Yeah, I believe so. Yeah, that, there's a oh, the Indian fuck. actor. Remember that she, he was smoking uh, cigarettes and dancing. There's that, this kid, the old YouTube clip. There's this kid. He was like, a, he was on a uh, Boston about. Bruins game, like Sam or something. He had it. Sam, I forget. <laughs> his, if you look it up, look it up right now. Benjamin Button disease, Sam, and I bet it pops up. How old was he? He died at like 17, I think. Benjamin. 18. And he looked 140. He looked like uh, like the oldest professor at your school. Sam Burns? Yeah, that might be it. Oh, oh he does look a professor. Yeah. Will you do a little... Re- I mean, can, uh, yeah. I want to see what Sam Burns he looks like. Scott. He looks quite different than Brad Pitt did. Well, yeah, that's movie. because he didn't oh, yeah, survive. Oh, it's, yeah, it's uh, progeria. Yeah. Because he didn't live, Tony. Not many people. He came from the country progeria. No, that's what the disease is called. You <laughs> piece of shit. It's over your left oh. shoulder, Nick. If you want to look. Yeah, yeah I, I've seen it. It's wild. So Age, that's what the disease. Like, so that's what the real Benjamin Button. Is? Yeah, this is like uh, Sam Fuckus on. He was on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> his name was Sim Fuckus. Sim yeah. Fuckus. Yeah, never yeah. heard of him. Oh, check. Do yourself a favor after Sim this. And, wormhole. Yeah, watch Sim Fuckus on YouTube. Okay. He's got oh, some, with a T, by the way. <laughs> yeah, you, yeah, T. Sim Fuckus. Sim Fuckus. With a T. Where's the T there? T S I M. Starts with T. Oh, T S I M. Sim, Sim okay. Fuckus. Okay, okay. Here's the T like Rex. <laughs> it's like what the hell? Uh, next. Hope the hope the gorillas are season peace. Ah, the Juno spacecraft orbiting Jupiter has discovered an FM radio signal coming from the moon. Ganymede. That's not real. Gany. Ganymede. Taylor made. Ganymede. The find is a first time detection from the moon. Well, there you go. I pictured like this. Juno. Yeah. Was orbiting and then like, they were like you heard that, and it, and it was. Like playing on the on the moon, there. they had like a faint. And they're like, "Do you hear that?" And then they just got louder and louder. And then they, "I am a real American, fight for the rights of every man. I am a real American, fight for your life, fight for your life." That was I'm a real American. You're listening to 1066 The Bones. Yeah, that'd be awesome. That'd be awesome. I assume that's what happened, right, Nick? Uh, I believe what actually happened was some type of natural occurrence, I'm air quoting natural, Mm -hmm. caused this signal to be released on the planet, and it was actually uh, interpreted as Wi Fi. Really? Seems what I read. Yeah. There's Mm -hmm. Wi Fi on Jupiter. So, yeah, if you're out there, free Wi Fi. What kind of natural occurrence creates Wi-Fi? Two rocks collide? No, nah, I mean, this is space magic, you know? Yeah. So we'll really get into a whole can of worms. Yeah. Who but. knows what black hole this signal traveled through? You know? yeah. True. You think it could be um, the last airbender? Avatar. Oh, shit. Aang? <laughs> That is correct. That is correct. You're fucking. <laughs> he really perked up there, didn't he? he? He should have seen his face. I mean, I had a fucking direct yeah. look at hey, look, if we're talking about fucking. Fuck. Aang? <laughs> I love the last airbender, dude. If he's real, bring him in. Go, go get him if he's real. <laughs> fucking take one of those space stations and start looking. Uh, I was more thinking of Doctor Strange, but. Oh, okay. Steve. Steven. Steven. Tony would be a big fire guy. What do you mean? Avatar. Yeah, you'd be the a last fire airbender. Guy. 
They're four nations, dude. Fire nation. That's a, yeah. that's you. What were the other ones? Earth and wind. Earth, air, water. Yeah. Earth, you might air, know by that song. Fire. Yeah. Yeah. Do September. You, what's your air nation? Oh, I'm air. Yeah. Or earth. Depends. I'm water, baby. You I get everyone wet. Is there a quiz that I could take? I think there's probably a quiz of what is there a buzz <laughs> what nation quiz? you are in Avatar: The Last Airbender. I'm sure there is. There is for sure a Buzzfeed quiz, but you, Nick, and Bill would all be firebenders. <laughs> Whoa! Suck it. Does that is that a fucking so that's a burn, shot. dude? Use fire, that fire, burn. fire! Yeah. I don't think that's a fucking shot. I think Buzzfeed does no, have I a think quiz I like right being here. Team fire, oh, those yeah. teammates. Which so element represents your personality? I'm gonna I'm gonna take this throughout as we're going through questions. <laughs> <There you go. laughs> I'll let you know at the there end of the show. Right. Fire Nation does have the coolest boats. But I'll here, say that. now that I've got a bad representation of fire, so I don't want to pick fire. No, no, they're pretty cool. There you have it. They have a cool uncle in the show. Twenty one questions. You found it too. Is it twenty one questions? I don't know. Next. Can we stop saying Oliver Platt is the guy from Lake Placid and put some fucking respect on Jimmy King's name? <laughs> I did forget that Oliver Platt was Jimmy King, and Jimmy King is an incredible character. Probably, maybe one other person in this room knows that reference. Who is Jimmy King? Jimmy King is the king, and he's going to crown you from Ready to Rumble with David Arquette. Oh, oh shit. Oh, wow. I Scott, <laughs> Scott Kahn. Yeah, Ooh. Scott Kahn, David Arquette, and Oliver Platt made a movie basically with WCW. Yeah. Had WCW. DDP in it. I think Goldberg was in it. A bunch of wrestlers about them trying to save the life of their uh, fan favorite growing up, Jimmy the King. That's Not nice. to be confused with Jerry the King Lawler. I mean, I'm going to stick to he's the guy from Lake Placid. You should. <laughs> but, but this is an incredible film. Ready to rumble. I have actually never seen it. But, but uh, you would love it. <laughs> I, I you specifically it would out. love it. I'm going to have to check it out. Because Jimmy King's a real piece of shit in the movie. Connor, I got a question for you. What's that, Tony? So in this quiz, it's asking me which Hogwarts house do do I belong to. Yeah. And I don't know that answer. Which Hogwarts house do you think oh, I would? Puff. You're fucking Jigglypuff. Dude. I think Tony might have been Slytherin. No, he's Hufflepuff, yeah, dude. He's Look Slytherin. at him. Well, it's, it's Ravenclaw, Gryffindor, Slytherin, or Hufflepuff. You're yeah, Slytherin. Hufflepuff, dude. I'm going to ask the expert. Give him Hufflepuff. I mean, look, Tony, I would say Hufflepuff. that you have a lot of different capabilities Slytherin. for any house, really. Okay. But if I was the sorting hat and I was on top of your brain. Go sit on him. I'm putting yeah. you in Ravenclaw. Okay, sweet. <laughs> what a loser. Putting you in Ravenclaw. I don't know. It sounds sweet. Mm -hmm. No, Enjoy, it dude. sucks, dude. Mm -hmm. Sounds Enjoy. like I'm a raptor. Well, the thing about Ravenclaw is they barely touched upon it in the films. And, uh, <laughs> you know, I can't put you in my house. And I, and I don't think what you're you? evil enough. Gryffindor. I don't think you're evil enough <laughs> to put you in Slytherin. So it's between the puff and Why the am claw. I not Gryffindor? Why? Yo, why is I am in Gryffindor? We can't all be in the same house, God I mean, damn how it. small are these fucking houses in Harry Listen, Potter? I've, rec one, I've only recently one. seen these movies, and I don't understand a lot of what's going on. But I know for a fact you ain't come close to being a Gryffindor. Yeah, dude. You and Gryffindor you, in the same sentence. You Connor does? Yeah, no, you. I'm not, you. But Connor does? Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, dude. He's got a, he's got a, yeah, dude. He's got a childlike <laughs> innocence about him. What? Well, oh, a childlike sense. Yeah, I don't have that. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Well, You're not Slytherin, though. So you, there's, the Gryffindors like TikTok. Some yeah. Of, some of them. They would be TikTokers. I mean, we know Bill's in Slytherin. That's all we True. Really yeah, he, true. Yeah. That's he fucking son of a speaks Possel Moth. Yeah, he does. <laughs> he's, that's he's the fucking heir to Slytherin. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Holy shit, Zed is too. <laughs> Next. That's fucked. What was the question last one? Z. Did you see on Nickelodeon? Oh, shut up, that dude. That's your, your favorite fucking Your show. favorite character, Young Sheldon, was up there fucking hey, If that was Young Star. Rock, I'd have been way happier. <clears throat> it's going to be real soon. Here's a question yeah. Have you watched Young Rock yet? No, it's not out yet. When is it out? They're filming it right now. Oh, so it's never making. I it thought it was, yeah. I mean, if they aren't, haven't started filming it yet, it's dead in the water. Sorry, no, no, no. See, no. it's uh, no, it's dead. No, it's not dead. Why did they put Young Sheldon in this thing? Well, to help clear up some of the penalties. But and, he's not uh, even Nickelodeon. Yeah, but he's the I smartest think he is, kid no. in the I believe world. he was right after this game. He was on. I think they picked him up. Really? 
that was my interpretation of what was going yeah, on. Yeah, I believe it's on CBS and then syndicated on Nickelodeon. Because uh, I did stick around after the game and watch 10 I'll tell you what, Young Sheldon's a bit of a... Of young Sheldon. How'd you look? Like <laughs> yes, I did. Well, he's a bit of a sawed-off prick, uh, isn't he? He's just fucking slap. Young Sheldon's a sawed-off prick. Yeah. Yes, big time. I stuck around because Bill Ponderosa <laughs> from... Uh, <laughs> Always Sunny is his dad in the show. <laughs> nice. And it was like a football themed thing, you know. I was like, eh, hey, fuck it. I mean, the show stinks, but, you know, it's Young Sheldon. Uh-huh. Yes, young I'm Sheldon. water. I'm the water nation. Nice. Just water watch. nation, yeah. Because you encompass a large mass. Yeah, because I get it wet. <laughs> <laughs> Next. Well done. Mitt. What's going on here, dude? For clarification, this is Mitt's tweet. For clarification, these socks were still in a package. I was, I was getting unwarmed. <laughs> Look at the damn picture. Un- Jesus. Unwarn. 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 That's no surprise. I, I messed up a tweet there. But I was getting ripped for uh, pulling socks out of my football bag that were uh, unworn. And then, uh, like, they were dirty. I don't know. People so it was very unwarranted internet. tweets out of you. Yeah, Ooh. Kind of just pandering. What are you talking about? I don't. I don't even know. <laughs> it's not as good as songs. Uh, on. I believe he <laughs> yeah, found true. he found a pair of elite socks and he took a picture and said these are comfy as fuck, <clears throat> and it was from his football bag. And then people were saying, "How did they know you wearing your football bag socks?" How did they know it was no. from your football bag, man? He's, I think he said it. Thank you, see, Jesus well, like, Christ! Oh, you so know it's bad when Zito has to provide the nah. reference and interpretation of the story. <laughs> yeah. I have an update. I am an air nomad. Oh, you're in the Air Nation. Mm-hmm. Oh no, they oh, good for you. Man. I don't you think lied. I don't think you'd love living up in the mountains, but hey, I good love. For you. What do you mean? air up there, Tony. Kidding Hard me? to breathe. I floating, love the mountains. <laughs> floating out mountains. Hey, you can't eat wings. These aren't mountain they mountains. Vegetarian. They're different types. Yeah, yeah, yeah like the mountains from Avatar. Avatar. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, the ones that float. Those are dangerous. Yeah, those are sweet. Now that I think about it, I think I might be Earth Nation. Really? Whoa! Yeah. Did you, ch- you wow. change over? Yeah. Well, I was thinking air or Earth, but now. Oh, you want to you don't want to be with me up on the air mountains? <laughs> I don't. You know, I I you just fucking made him change his fucking the nation, thought of bro. Falling off a. You know what? Yeah, I will, Tony. I'll stay <laughs> in the air nation. You convince me. Fuck it. Thank you. I mean, we could be fucking jumping from air mountain to air mountain, flying dude. around. Kidding me? Just can just fucking <laughs> air. I'm yeah. gonna have to watch this, huh? It's awesome. It's, it's there's three fun. seasons. I think it's like sixty episodes total. It's a child's play. Yeah, animated. And if you get bored, watch old school X Men on Disney. Play? <laughs> <laughs> Basically, uh, Appa Yip Yip, you're gonna fucking love Appa. I'll tell you that much. I already love Appa. <laughs> yeah, Appa. I, he seems like an elder that I'm gonna love. <laughs> yeah. is he an elder? He is an animal that Aang rides. He is his travel companion. <laughs> oh. Appa Yip Yip. Appa like a, Yip Yip. He's a fucking massive like <laughs> buffalo air bison. Air bison. Thank well, you, man. I just changed my fucking Twitter name to Appa Yip Yip. <laughs> <Yeah>. so, <laughs> smart. The Go Big Show is surprisingly fun to watch. It's like the opposite of Big Sky. Ooh, oh, Go Big! Dalton from the rafters. Has anyone? That didn't. I didn't say that. It was Dalton Seal. Um, I said Dalton. Oh my bad. Uh, <laughs> has anyone seen the Go Big Show yet? Nah, and I'm probably not gonna watch it. Did nah, you? Watch? I saw a segment of it. Like I saw a bit. This is dude. It would, so they pit two people against each other, two acts against Shut each up. other. Okay. And one was <laughs> this British girl who was an archer who could use her feet, so she was a foot archer. Not anymore, archer. What? <laughs> Fetch me an air, archer. <laughs> Not now, witcher. Yeah, was it a witcher? <laughs> <laughs> it really went for it. It, it was, because he said that earlier, <laughs> so you know it has been on his brain today. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta get it out. Oh, and fed then, I fed that to Tony five hours ago. <laughs> oh, I like that move. <laughs> Feed me. <laughs> and then there was a guy she was going against who looked exactly like Zito. And he built himself as uh, the, real, <laughs> the real mutant. Oh, I heard that. I ain't no fucking hurt. <laughs> he, he I wish I'd be early and win the fucking lottery. <laughs> And fucking win billions of dollars and jump on a plane. I knew you weren't going to be happy about that. Lizzie. I uh, knew you weren't. You know what sucks too? I'm pretty sure he's in prison break. No. I went back just to watch Hunter so. laugh. I went what back movie? Just, 
I, I was down in the about. dumps on Sunday night, so I went back to watch Connor laugh at that. Man, I was pissing my pants. Uh, oh, no. were you, dude? <laughs> oh, you're so cool, dude. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, he is in another movie, though, where he is like a prisoner or some shit. Was he in yeah, Death Race? He's a convict. I br- that's prison break, Jason right? Statham. Was he in Death Race? I don't know. Mechanic, maybe? I guess oh, the go. mechanic? <laughs> What's what? his name in real life? Jorge Garcia. Hugo Sanchez. <laughs> <laughs> trying to it see. It's not Hugo Sanchez. That was a soccer player. Trying to see what Jorge, what else Jorge Garcia was. <laughs> Just search <was>. Hurley <laughs> lost and he'll pop up. <laughs> it is Hugo Reyes. Ah, close. Can we, that? <clears throat> close. Can he was we play a fucking... clip from this show, from Go Big Show? I need. I think you guys need to see the mutant. I want to see. I the doubt mutant. that we're allowed to play it on the show. Oh man. It's just called the mutant. Fucking Hugo Sanchez. All right, we'll cut. We'll cut this part out then, or something, because you you need to see it. All right, cut it out, Bill. Well, how are we seeing it? I don't know. Okay, next. <laughs> we will see it. Paul Wright. What are you talking about? Here. This guy sticks cans <laughs> to his skin, like empty, like Coke aluminum Zero. cans. Coke Zero cans. Yeah, uh, I don't know why he wants Coke Zero, but yeah. <laughs> and they, he just. Like rubs them on his face and they stick there. What? And they stay. The mutant. <laughs> he the puts a, mutants. He puts a bottle of tequila, a bottle of Patron, on the back of his head, and it stays there. And he pours Burt Kreischer a shot. Who is this? The mutant. The mutant. It looks just like Zito. It's from wild. the Big Show. Jorge Sanchez. No, the mutant. Oh. Turns up when you Google you go the mutant, the Big Show, which just pictures the Big Show. Where? <laughs> Oh, oh shit, it's the Go Big Show. Yeah. Big that was the issue. Oh, pops up for it. No. it must be too new. Are we cutting all oh, this Oh, I out? see this guy. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> or what? No, no, no. We I just, didn't know. No, <laughs> he does. I mean, yeah, I'll show you a picture. He just got, he's got cans stuck to his face. Oh. oh. He's so a human the, suction pad. So he just glues the bottom of the cans. Potentially. Man. Watch this. Next. This is a uh, post on Facebook, I believe, and it says, Bro, you 18 plus, stop ordering chicken strips everywhere you go. I'd like it to be known for the listeners of this show. We all <laughs> order chicken strips everywhere we go. Uh, every place. Copy, are you about to say that you don't? I mean, I don't, but I don't have a problem with it. I, or, I order chicken strips on Sunday. This it's guy really? means like chicken tenders, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah I chicken tendies, dude. You I, don't order chicken tendies? I love chicken tendies. I love chicken tenders. I know. I do. I, love yeah. chicken I enjoy them too. I, do. I would go wings though if we, if there's a choice. I'd rather have wings. Well, yeah, they're wingies. There's the uh, there's the mutant. Oh, nice, that looks nothing dude. like me, by the way. What do you mean? Mm. It looks nothing like me. Z, you well, should. Get... His goatee's a little fuller, but huh. you should oh, get one of those shirts see. though. Yeah, you should. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know about that. <clears throat> I'm just saying, like, there's nothing wrong with chicken tenders. No, no, not at yeah. all. No. Chicken tenders are good. Get a couple dipping sauces. A little honey mustard. Get it blackened. Buffalo. Oh. Does this one does food have an age limit, huh? Seriously. Uh, baby that's food. That's a good point. Aside from baby food, but that's because it's. I don't know. Have you had prequel. the Nanner's baby food recently? Oh, no. that's good. It's fucking delicious. Really? Yeah. Huh. Where are you eating that at? My fucking house. There used to be stores? one of the. Sometimes UFC. I accidentally turned down the baby food. I want to pick up a. I don't know if it was Jordan Matt Hughes, Hughes, one of the UFC fighters. That's all he ate when he was like cutting for a fight. Baby food, mm-hmm. high in protein, for no fat. Yeah, yeah it's a lot of weird. nutrients. Okay, next. Yeah. You gotta use a small spoon. That's right. It's very small. Mm-hmm. One of those rubber ones. Yeah, baby spoon. Yeah. A spork, so it doesn't hurt your teeth. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Dude, there's a there's what is this? A 360 it's treadmill. Th- oh yeah. So you can walk in fucking virtual reality games. This I'm is what in. if you ever watched uh, First <clears throat> Kid, this is what he was walking on. Oh yeah, so like in the mall. <clears throat> so you play Call of Duty on virtual reality, and like, run, like this dude in this video was running yeah. and fucking. It's intense. Looks intense, at least. Never I'm tried. just happy. Finally, 20 years later, they fucking did it. It's it looks time. like it's very easy to hurt yourself on as well. Yeah, I would. No, you're strapped so. in. Yeah, you're you got like off. a get back coach holding you back the entire time. Yeah, so I still think you could fucking roll your ankle, twist your knee up pretty well, yeah, good on there. Yeah, that's part no. of. That's, I mean, that's part no. of war. So we had this at IUPUI True. actually at my college, and you get into like this suspension system where like it kind of like pulls you up, mm-hmm. so that way you're like very light on your feet. So that yeah. way it's tough to kind of like. Oh, so it's kind of like a pull up machine that. 
It's more like one of those like baby fucking bouncy <laughs> yeah. deuce. But yeah, God. yeah you Tell can me. eat your baby food and bounce around on your baby bouncy here. Count me in. Dude. I actually got that reference, Tony, because I always have to use that. Uh, yeah, because you can't because we can't do pull ups on our own, so you need to wait. Bad shoulders. Wait to assist. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I hear you. So uh, you're you're not actually putting any weight <laughs> on the ground. Not really. So you no. can just live in this world for the rest of your life. See, I don't yeah. like that. I feel like I would want to be boots yeah, on yeah, the ground yeah. a little more. Like, how can I make a cut? Yeah, exactly. I do believe. Like, if I want, if I'm playing Madden, I feel like you feel lighter True. on your feet. Yeah. All right. Well, you got to think well, about your yeah. virtual. You're of course, you're being lighter on up. your feet. You're wearing those. <laughs> you're wearing those Nickelodeon moon shoes. Oh, can we bring those back? Those are awesome. I don't think I ever had a pair, but that, I was like, those look cool. Yeah, I never had one. Same. What moon shoes? That's why I want them. I, I don't think my parents yeah. never got. They also didn't let me order the magazine. No, no same. Nick magazine. Yeah, for kids. Fucking mm-hmm. top kid on the block always had moon uh, shoes and whole cans. Mm-hmm. Uh, last week I actually uh, bought some stuff off. Uh, remember when you were a kid, and Scholastic. Yeah, Scholastic yeah, book fair, mm-hmm. baby. Yeah, I bought like forty things this weekend. What did you buy? At the book fair. Yeah, all the, like the magic. I, I got. I bought a magic book. The Gathering. No, no, like you could do magic. Magic trick. Oh, nice. Yeah, okay. I did that. Okay. You too. Uh, there was a couple other things, but uh, Captain Underpants, I got three of those books. Ooh, I love those. And then uh, I got the new Harry Potter series in a trunk. Yeah, I spent like $400. I probably shouldn't have. <laughs> the but. new Harry Potter series. You yeah, said. they redid the, the, Hold the on covers. You went so, to Scholastic.com. <laughs> 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 oh, dude. I brought it back with my parents so I couldn't get it, and I just got it. Fuck yeah. And we yeah. single handedly kept them these. afloat during the pandemic. <laughs> yeah, dude. Read them. What do you mean? <laughs> what was the first thing that you said you bought? Uh, Magic. It's like a. No, no, after that, sorry. Captain uh, the Underpants. Captain Underpants series. Dude, you never heard of Captain Underpants? You're going to read these? No. It's going to be looked at on a, in a bookshelf. Okay. <laughs> Fuck yeah. They're like eight pages long, too. <laughs> You take the all pictures. <laughs> Dude, that is, actually, that is hilarious. If someone walks into your living room and on a bookshelf, you have the three Captain Underpants <laughs> My library? Are you going to take the fucking source. accelerated reader test after you read them, dude? Uh, who else watched the Harry Potter movie and uh, did the... That book was like white, I'm pretty sure, like, on the level. And I got a free trip to Great America. Or Six Flags, sorry. <laughs> what the no are you talking about? fucking clue. Oh, you didn't have to like read. Oh, you guys didn't have like uh, Six Flags in your towns, did you? We I had Six Flags. I had Six Flags. Dusky, so, Ohio. See, yeah, see oh, so we actually oh. had it in our that, state. That's actually so Cedar Point. And but. if you read books and you did the test and you passed it, you got a free admittance yes. Yes. into Six Flags. And then I watched a movie, so I only needed one of that color. Yeah. And I fucking got in, and I just. So I watched the movie. No, I, I did. You have a good day at the, the amusement park? Yeah, dude, I fucking won the, the big drop. See, I thought you were saying like you read a Harry Potter book, and at the end of it, it was like, "Congratulations, <laughs> <laughs> you just won a trip." To six <laughs> one ticket. No, no, no. I, I did the test without reading it. We well, didn't yeah, know we had that. I also assume you read the book without reading it. <laughs> yeah. What next? <clears throat> Nick, you sent me this. Yeah, I didn't read it, but it's pretty awesome. Uh. There's a Peacemaker spinoff, huh. and if you don't know Peacemaker, that is uh, John Cena's character. That's not true. Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. No, no, no. So I, am, I, I was a bit confused initially because, because I, John Cena's character is John Cena. Yes, I did I think told. John Cena was just John Cena in this movie. It turns out he is the Peacemaker. Yeah. Oh, so, oh. You, guys, yeah. so you guys were wrong. No, for those initially, initially. That you were when he takes the mask off, he's John Cena. You guys, yeah, you guys kept, kept telling me that John Cena was going to be in his wrestling gear. Right. He is when he takes the mask. And off. I, yeah, there's nothing on. here in this headline that says he's not going to be in Cena regalia. Yeah. Yeah. And then he says <laughs> joins John Cena. Yeah. Oh, that's a good point. Well, if he's going to be in Cena Regalia, that changes. It's John Cena as Peacemaker. In so the movie God. starts, he's John Cena in full Regalia, and then he becomes Peacemaker in the movie. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. That clears things up. And he eats a lot of empanadas. So there's going to be a spinoff series. <laughs> Just him. Of John Cena becoming the Peacemaker? We got I assume so. Superhero Cena. Well, prequel, yeah. yeah. I think it's going to maybe be on a WWE network. <laughs> Probably. Is that right? Yeah, because it, they'll have some free you know, the, the rights to his previous matches. <laughs> <laughs> some of the earlier episodes. The backstory. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was going right to Disney+. Plus. Yeah. Free to new subscribers. It, uh, it might be, but I'm pretty sure I saw a WWE network. I you get it with a bundle. Okay. Yeah. There's a bundle. Oh, mm-hmm. oh okay. Next. I don't know who Matt Miller is, though. No. I think he's the guy who did uh, fucking goddamn. He's in Deadpool. What was the, the movie with? I can't. Nick TJ, Cage and uh, Ghost Rider. Oh, no, <laughs> he was Big Daddy in it with fuck. 
And McLovin was in it too. He was the bad guy. It was like a superhero movie with Aaron Kick Taylor ass. Johnson. Oh. Kick ass. Oh, I think he I think Matt Miller made stunk. kick ass. Yikes. You said that movie stunk. <laughs> Next. More of a green morning <clears throat> guy. Yeah, I mean I didn't think it was great, but you know. I was there, a big kick ass guy. He made it. Has there ever been a bigger underdog betting wise when it than when it comes to Hector <clears throat> having to fight Achilles and Troy after Hector kills his cousin? Well, Tony. We talked about that. If you didn't have COVID, because you forgot that takes all, so you'd know we talked about this <laughs> yeah. and answered this question already. Yeah. Well, Tony. came back through. I hope one of you guys brought up that fucking Rocky and Tum Tum and Colt on the basketball court against those kids was probably the biggest underdog fucking. <laughs> we, we mentioned several underdog stories mm-hmm. that were all better. I hope yeah. that one was. Were they an underdog, though? Because you could argue they were like plus nine. Or no, I'm saying, they were, I'm, saying they were they, the, I'm saying they were the favorites, but the yeah. other kids. Okay, there you go. Yeah. Fat Stooge and Bully Kid yep. and Sidekick. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think Bill said Z against COVID, which was pretty fucked up. Whoa. Whoa. That was Bill. Whoa. Whoa. Turns out Z won. Fucking right. Maybe. I think I Next. think got Oh, Tony. Did Tony. you stop eating meat? No, did not. Can't okay. stop, won't stop. You got the cure is what you're saying. Oh, I just thought of one, actually. Oh, oh, Troy it. beating LSU. Yeah, that fucked me my uh, freshman year. That was my introduction to gambling. Jesus. You're talking uh, about... Oh, what? nice, dude. Fuck you. Mitt. What a fuck. You are one dumb son bitch, aren't you, Mitt? <laughs> what? I don't know yeah. any movies. It is you're real shit. Yeah. You got, you got rocks for brains. What? Man. You got nothing in between your ears. What? Man. You got the IQ of a mouse, what? a lab rat, what? a dipshit, what? a dumbass, what? someone who isn't smart, what? moronic. What? <laughs> That's right. That was a good run. That was a good run. What? A doof. <laughs> a doofus. <laughs> Buffoon. Uh. What? That was a tough game, though, man. I remember that. Yeah. I remember that Troy vs. LSU game. Yeah, no, I think we, I think we settled oh, on Mighty Ducks. It. I think was the one mm-hmm. uh, against Team we Iceland. Had to have a little tutor. Giants. Little Giants was in there. Oh, I was about to say, yeah. <laughs> was that who posted the clip? Someone posted <laughs> the, the clip of uh, <laughs> Danny O'Shea saying, "You know what's the difference? We get the ball, we're gonna ram it down your throat. You <laughs> get the ball." It wasn't me. It was the ball. Oh yeah, that no, was it was me. Nick. Fucking yeah. Cleveland yeah. was up twenty-eight nothing. That was great. Uh, all right, uh, we'll be back Friday. What? 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 Is Nick gonna have bangers? Yeah, I will remember this week with bangers. And had vacation brain. And he's got a special Mad Lib. No. So. no. Ooh. Well, we'll just start teasing now. Eventually, holiday will come around. New, right. new Lib. MLK Day. Shut up. There it is. <laughs> we'll do an MLK Mad Lib. <laughs> the week of uh, MLK Day. We'll do a Mad Lib. <laughs> Wait, is that, that's next week. Yeah, that is. It's coming up. It's Monday. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Well, okay. Doc. Oh, could do a Super Bowl Madeline. Could, yeah. yeah. Super Bowl mm. Madeline. We'll see. Good, oh, you don't want to do an MLK Madeline? No, I would What's love that. It sounds okay. like oh, they're out on the MLK. I, would, oh, oh, I mean, oh, I would love oh, to do oh, an MLK. Dude. I'm just saying I don't want to be too much on you. You know, just quick turnaround. C- can you find a Super Bowl Mad Lib after we do the MLK one, of course? <laughs> well, you do find a Super Bowl Mad Lib where it talks about stuff <laughs> where like that we're going to be bringing to the Super Bowl party. Can we yeah. do an early oh. Easter one? That's a good one. Easter Lib? We'll do a Jesus Mad Lib. I like that. We should do that. You have Valentine's Day in there as well. Yep. Oh, can we do a Steeler one? St. Patrick's Day. Uh, uh-huh. There's a lot. There's a lot okay. on the docket. Well, flag Day coming up? <laughs> well, I'm looking forward to. Flag Day might be right around the corner. <laughs> I thought it was. Now that you mention it. Yeah. No, it's I always after it. Arbor Day. <laughs> is it? Oh, so I'm thinking of Arbor Day, then. That's Tree Day. Flag Day is Monday, June 14th. Well, it's okay. Yeah. It's right around the corner here. Yeah. Nice. We, we can get off that. Not. Arbor Day is Friday, April 30th. See, like I said, it's Flag Day is always after Arbor Day. You're right. So we got some time then. Yeah. Oh, tomorrow is Orthodox New Year. Oh, we oh, were nice. thinking. Oh, speaking of Chinese New Year is also coming up. What year are you, the fucking pig, dude? Mongoose? Pig, bro. <laughs> you would be a uh, pig, you uh, loser. <laughs> <laughs> loser. What? You want to know that? Hey, what? ask me what I am. Come on. What are you, Tony? Fucking dragon, dude. Really? Mm. Yeah, you are. Really? Fuck, maybe yeah. you were in Slytherin. <laughs> No, it says I was an airbender. Oh, yeah. Uh, different movie, different but thing. yeah. I'll fucking slither right out of here, dude. <laughs> See you Friday. <laughs>